Okay. Write the question. If P and Q are the zeros of the polynomial, if P and Q, if P and Q are the zeros of the polynomial, if P and Q are the zeros of the polynomial, if P and Q are the zeros of the polynomial, P of X equal to two X square minus seven X plus three. P of X equal to two X square minus seven X plus three. Find the value of P square plus Q square. Find the value of P square minus Q square. Find the value of P square plus Q square. P square plus Q square. Okay. Okay. Uh, I'll listen. Uh, P and Q, uh, P and Q are the zeros of this polynomial. Then find the value of P square plus Q square. What you will write? P square plus Q square equal to P plus Q all square minus two P Q. Okay. Uh, my question. Uh, my question. Uh, Anugrah, what is P plus Q? What? P plus Q is what? P plus Q, what? Hello, Anigrav. Come on. P plus Q. You, you heard no alpha plus beta. Uh, alpha, beta, what? In that. P plus Q. I know minus B by A. What is this in this question? Anigrav, I know what minus B by A. What is in this question? Seven by two, good. That's all I'm asking you. Seven by two, seven by two whole square minus two into PQ what? PQ is C by A, three by two, right? Three by two. So that means 49 by four minus six by two. Okay, simplify six by, yeah, six by three, 49 minus three. Simplify the answer. Hello, you, you should know, uh, I hope there is no cubic polynomial, right or not? Even even the example five, not Newton, right? Better you make sure example five. That is the part before two point two. You confirm that all, right? Okay. So right now, um, this one, uh, Afia, Afia, the Bavans. We got any assignments? I know uh, chapter one. You got assignment. What about chapter two? You got only worksheet. Okay, send me the worksheet. Send me the worksheet. Okay, now, 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 now uh, we can discuss now that. Okay. Why, why not sending uh, up here? Uh, if you, if uh, you are the responsible, your school, anyone, anything, uh, uh, assignment, or get informed. Me. Okay, send me that. Okay, because I don't have any connection with school. Any of the schools? What once again? This one. What? What once again? This one. Okay, my dear. This is uh, you should know uh, alpha plus beta minus b by a, alpha beta c by a. That is the main of this chapter. Alpha plus beta equal to minus b by a, alpha beta c by a. Alpha plus beta what? Minus of minus seven by two. Alpha beta. C by A, 3 by 2. Substitute this one. Final answer. What's the answer? What is the answer? Okay. So, what is the answer? That's 7 by 4. Right or not? I mean, okay now? Marsuk, I know uh, Marsuk, that is not coming for test. Okay. Okay. So then why you bother now? Thank you. 
Okay. Yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm checking that. Okay. If you send now here, I cannot uh, download. Okay. Let me see that possible or not. Okay, because I'm recording now. That's the problem. I cannot minimize. No, I cannot minimize. That's the thing. I'm recording. That's why I cannot minimize. Okay. Send me in WhatsApp. Okay. 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 Yeah, I, I'm sending that. Okay. Uh, our DPS, I got already. I discussed. No, DPS students don't need to send it. DPS students don't need to send. I already discussed. I got it. Akshaya sent me. Okay. She said uh, uh, immediately. She sent. Okay, next question. Uh, next one. Hello, finish. Right. If M at N, next question. Today only just permissions, then uh, next Sunday onwards we'll do the new chapter, linear equations in two variables. After that, I'll come back to uh, cubic polynomial. A lot of things to do that cubic polynomial. Okay, right. If M and N are the zeros of if M and N, if M and N, M and N are the zeros of the polynomial, if M and N, if M and N are the zeros of the polynomial, M and N are the zeros of the polynomial. Okay, three x square, three x square plus eleven x minus four. Three x square plus eleven x minus four. Find the value of m by n plus n by m. Okay, before that, listen. If anyone doubt, I'm repeating again. Three uh, x square plus two x plus one. What is Alpha plus beta, Adil. Come on, Adil. Three x square plus two x plus one. What is alpha plus beta? Adil, Mojur. Come on, Adil. Minus two by three. Good. Alpha, beta, one by three. Amen. You know this one, right? Hello, Amen. Okay. Okay, that's only this. If you know that, okay, and also uh, the basic things, uh, the graph of quadratic polynomial, what shape? The graph of a quadratic polynomial shape, what is the shape? Parabola. Okay, when we come to know the parabola open up, when we come to know parabola open up, when we come to know parabola open up, A positive. A positive, A greater than zero, A greater than zero, A greater than zero. Uh, if A less than zero, open down. Ahmed, your class which chapter now? Ahmed? Polynomials, okay. Ahmed, it's okay now, video uh, um, volume. Uh, oh, is that clear now? Because uh, your class time, I'll change the net to another one. Is it okay, Ahmed? Everyone okay now? You can see the video, right? Adav. Okay, microphone, what's the problem? What about um, this one? Video not perfect. Come on, man. Okay, video also perfect. Okay. So, so very big, it's a very big screen here in front of me. Okay. Even you, even you uh, all open the camera, also no problem. Okay. Uh, now look at the question. Uh, M and N, M and N, M and N, M 
m and n are the zero of the polynomial 3x square plus 11x minus 4. Find the value of m by n plus n by m. Okay, you want to try? Uh, look at here. One method is hello. One method, if we can try to find m and n separately by splitting the middle term, that's fine. Otherwise, okay, listen, two methods I'll show you. Hello, wait, wait, wait. Two methods. One method, I'm going to split 3x square plus 11x minus 4 equal to 0. Sure. 3x square plus 11. 12x minus x minus 4. Correct or no? 12 into 1, uh, 12, 12 minus 1, uh, 11. 3x outside x plus 4 minus of x plus 4. x plus 4 into 3x minus 1. x plus 4 into 3x minus 1. Okay. Then we got 3x equal to minus 4 and x equal to 1 by 3. That means m equal to minus 4, m e, uh, n equal to minus m equal to minus 4, n equal to my n equal to 1 by 3. n equal to 1 by 3. Okay. Try now. First, you write this one. First by splitting the bed. Okay. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Okay. I'll check it. Other. Oh, no. Okay, I'll check it. So, you got m. Uh, what is the answer now? M equal to minus four. N equal to minus one by three. Substitute and find out here. M equal to m equal to minus four, and this is by splitting the middle term. This is by switching the middle term. Yeah, I got it. Other okay. Okay. Hey. No. Uh, other your calculation is wrong. Okay. Look. Uh, minus four. Minus four divided by n is one by one by three. One by three plus one by three divided by minus four. Minus twelve plus minus four by three. That is three here. Minus thirty six plus four. No, wrong what I said, right? Something wrong I did. Yeah, okay, look at here. Wait, 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 wait. What I did, uh, what I did, m equal to what? Minus 4, right? m equal to minus 4. Minus 4 
divided by n is n is 1 by 3 plus uh, 1 by 3 divided by minus 4. So that is uh, 3 going up minus 12 plus 1 by minus 12. Correct. Yeah, now correct. No? Okay. I don't, I have, no, I, you, every time I'm using the calculator, I have problem with addition. Okay. Uh, minus 12 is the FTM. Minus 144. Uh, 12 is the LCM, right? Minus 1. Minus 145 by 12. Yes. Minus 145 by 12. Minus 145 by 12. Okay, so uh, this one another method. Hey, hello. Suppose if you have problem with the still you have problem with the uh, splitting the middle term and Akshaya, listen. Some question, uh, some question we cannot split. So what we will do? If you cannot split, I show you method. Look at here. If you cannot split, don't don't, don't think all question we can split. Okay. Suppose some question we cannot split, we can find another method. Look. Here LCM is what M n M square plus N square and M square plus N square equal to what M plus N all square minus two M n divided by M n. Okay, apply uh, M plus N minus eleven by three all square minus two into minus 4 by 3 divided by mn. mn is uh, minus 4 by Then also we'll get it. This way also we can find, okay? Okay, we can, yeah, that's the same alpha plus beta instead of here m plus n, okay? This method also you can use it. Akshaya, sometimes, hey, hello, listen. Sometimes, sometimes we cannot split some quadratic polynomials. So that time, use this method okay uh, m square plus n square by m n. m square plus n square is what m plus n whole square minus 2 m n divided by m n but if we can split that is the best easiest way okay Okay, so next question. Uh, find if alpha and beta, if alpha and beta. If alpha and beta 
if alpha and beta if alpha and beta are the zeros of polynomial if alpha and beta are the zeros of the polynomial if alpha and beta are the zeros of polynomial if alpha and beta are the zeros of the polynomial f of x equal to x square minus 6x plus k f of x equal to x square minus 6x plus k okay find the value of k find the value of k find the value find the value of k such that alpha square plus beta square equal to 40. f of x equal to, listen, f of x equal to x square minus 6x plus k, such that alpha square plus beta square equal to 40. Find the value of k. Okay, try now. Okay, right now. Wait, 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 I'll, I'll check it.
Okay, finish. Okay, look at here. First of, hey, listen. First, you write alpha plus beta. This is first you write six alpha beta k. Go to here. Alpha square plus beta square. Alpha plus beta whole square minus two alpha beta. Two alpha beta. What is that? Alpha plus beta six. Thirty six minus. 2k equal to 40 uh, minus 4 equal to 2k minus 4 equal to my 2k k equal to minus 2 k equal to minus 2 for all got k equal to minus 2 Clear now? Everybody okay? Correct it down. Okay, next. Okay, listen here. First, uh, Adam, first you write alpha plus beta what? Alpha plus beta what? Six. That is the base. Alpha plus beta six. Alpha beta k. K by one. Then alpha square plus beta square formula is what? Alpha plus beta whole square minus two alpha beta. Substitute alpha plus beta six, 36 minus two K equal to 40. Minus four equal to two K, K equal to minus two. Okay. Okay. I mean, okay now. So next question, right? You by, by heard these things: alpha plus beta minus b by a, alpha beta c by a. Then substitute there. Okay. Next one. Uh, Anigraf, you got Adil. Finish or not? Alira. Kasia. Finish. Okay. Adil, your school still in first chapter. Your school going very slow. Good. Adil. Uh, Rudiga, finish or not? Devanda. Emma. Huh? 
Hello, Vima. Okay, you got now. Okay. So next question, right? If the sum and product of the zeros are polynomial, this is just a revision we did already. If the sum and product of the zeros are polynomial, if the sum today we have test you already prepared now. Okay. Uh, if the sum and product of the zeros are polynomial, if the sum and product of the zeros are polynomial, if the sum If the sum and product of the zeros are polynomial, if the sum and product of the zeros are the polynomial, if the sum and zeros of if the sum and product of the zeros are polynomial, a x square minus five x plus c, a x square minus five x plus c, a x square. A x square minus five x plus c. If the sum and product, if if uh, if 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 the sum and product, if the sum and product of the zeros are polynomial, a x square minus a x square minus five x plus c are ten each. Are ten each. Find the value of a and c. Find the value of a and c. Find find the value of a and c. Okay, the sum is ten. Product also ten. Find the value of a and c. Try now. Question clear or not? Question is what? The sum, the sum and product. Listen, the sum and product of the zeros of the polynomial a x square minus five x plus c. Are equal to ten each. Yeah, ten, 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 ten. Sum is ten. A x square minus five x plus c. Sum equal to ten. Sum equal to ten. Alpha plus beta. Alpha plus beta equal to ten. Alpha beta also ten. Okay, we have to find out a and c. Sum equal to sum equal to ten. Product also ten. Find the value of a and c. Clear now? Test is uh, Afia. Why are you asking like that tomorrow? Every Thursday test no, right? Afia, last this uh, this uh, test is what? Uh, today test is fifth test this year. Correct or no? Tomorrow means what? You 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 read today? Yesterday only I said. <laughs> you read today. You late. That's why. Okay. Next time I'll put the date. Okay. Next time I'll put the link. No, no, no need to uh, inform. I'm just reminding you. Okay, every uh, every th every Thursday we have test. Okay, At last year we did around 47 tests the list. That means from uh, March till March till February, right? Right or not? Till March, yes. Throughout the year, one year without any break. Including uh, summer holidays, also we did test every Thursday, nine o'clock our test. Okay. 
Okay, finish this one. Okay, finish. Uh, look at here. I'll show this one. Look, alpha plus beta equal to five by a equal to ten. Alpha plus beta five by a equal to ten. Five equal to ten a. A equal to five by ten equal to one by two. Five equal to ten a. A a a equal to one by two. Then alpha beta equal to c by a, c by a, c what? Uh, that also ten. So ten equal to c by one by two. Ten equal to five uh, c. Okay, two c. Uh, c how much? Five, correct? C equal to five. Are you okay now? Oh, question repeating now. If it is answer, alpha the sum the sum and product of hello the sum and product. Look at here. The sum. The question is what? The question is the sum and product of this polynomial. Listen, the sum and product of this polynomial is ten each. That means. Alpha plus beta equal to ten. Alpha beta equal to ten. Find the value of a and c. This is the question. Okay. Here yeah, now. Question is this is the question. Sum equal to ten. Uh, product also ten. Okay. Then we know alpha plus beta c by a equal to ten. Uh, okay. Uh, alpha plus beta ten uh, equal to Alpha plus beta 10, 10 equal to 5 by a. 10 a equal to 5. a equal to 5 by 10 equal to 1 by 2. Then go to product. Alpha beta equal to 10. Uh, C by a equal to 10. C by 1 by 2 equal to 10. 2 C equal to 10. C equal to 5. C equal to 5. Okay. Okay, so next one.
Okay. Find the zero of next question. Find the zeros of four x square plus twenty four x plus thirty six. Four x square plus twenty four x plus thirty six. Find the zeros of find the zeros of four x square plus thirty four x. Sorry, twenty four x plus thirty six. Find the question again. Find the find the zeros of four x square plus twenty four x plus thirty six. What? Both zeros are minus three. Sure. What the question? What the question I gave? Because I changed the question. Four x square plus twenty four x. Look. Four x square. Four x square plus. Twenty four x plus thirty six. Okay, we can take straight away common four outside x square plus six x plus. Oh, not four not going in. Okay, okay. So now not to allow take. You cannot take four outside. No. Okay. Then okay. And uh, two outside. Two x square plus twelve x plus eighteen. Okay, still going. You know. Yeah, we can take four outside. Four outside x square plus six x plus nine. Then x square plus six x plus nine. Splitting what? X plus we can split or not? Yeah, x plus three whole square. Right or not? So that means minus three. Correct or not? Minus three. Minus three. Minus three. Two times right. Minus three, minus three, squaring now, right? Minus three, minus three. These are the zeros. Repeat the zeros. Okay, right? Repeat the zeros. Okay, yeah. Uh, hello, Zaha. Are you getting or not, Zaha? Because you, for you, maybe page problem because they all revision only. How can I zero? How can I write zero? Write zero. Achaya, what basis you writing zero? <laughs> Look at here. I'll show that. Hey, come on. I, I'll I'll explain that your doubt. Okay. Anyway, your doubt. Hey, listen here. Four x square plus twenty four x plus thirty six. Four outside x square plus Six uh, x plus nine equal to zero, right? Okay, that means four not equal to zero. Four, how come zero? Four not equal to zero. Therefore, x square plus six x plus nine equal to zero. The product of Akshaya, listen up. The product of a a into b equal to zero means. Either a zero or b zero or both are zero. Here a not equal to zero. Of course b is zero. And listen up. The product of the product of two numbers are zero means either first number zero or 
second number zero or both of zero. Here, first number cannot be zero. Why? For never zero, for four only. Therefore, x square plus six x plus nine equal to zero. That means x plus three into x plus three equal to zero. That means x equal to minus three comma minus three. Clear now? Yeah, we can, we'll get it. We, we can fit without splitting also, no problem. That's also we'll do. But we, because we can do, with, without splitting also we can, without taking four also we can do it. But same answer only, okay? Answer no change, that's up to you. We'll get a little bit big, difficult uh, part. Up here, finish or not? Okay, I gave you this ear paper only. Next question. Uh, find the zeros of 100 x square minus 81. Find the zeros of 100 x square minus 81. 100 x square minus 81. 100 x square minus 81. Okay. This Bhavan's uh, two, you know, uh, what is the name of other school name? Smart. Okay. Okay. Uh, yeah, uh, yeah, you're in smart. Uh, for all in smart here. Advain. Okay. Ah, only uh, up here only smart. Okay, only okay. But what about the question paper? Or same, same for Bhavan? Uh, Zebra. Okay. No, no. My question, your question paper are same, right? Okay. But you miss your school uh, food now. You will get free food uh, during the regular classes, right? All Bhavans. Hey, come on, Bhavan's uh, last year, last uh, two year back, Bhavan said they have food, free food from school, no need to uh, take food from home. No? Oh, okay, okay. Oh, I thought like that. Because I, was, I think before like that, no, two year back. Two year back students told me, uh, just go and sit. In the canteen, they will give the food. Okay. So next question. Hey, come on. We got this one. Okay. Okay, this answer. Okay, this answer I tell you. Okay, look at here. Uh, hundred x square equal to eighty one. X square equal to eighty one by hundred. X equal to what? Plus or minus nine by ten. Plus or minus nine by ten. Okay. Plus or minus nine by ten because uh, S, I told you this every time. Uh, DPS students, careful this one. Okay, see here. A square equal to twenty five. A square equal to twenty five. A equal to what? Plus or minus five. Don't miss minus. Plus or minus five. Okay. Hello. A square equal to hundred. A equal to what? 
Uh, that's okay. A, a square equal to 100, A equal to plus or minus 10. Clear now? Zaha, Shahid, Sanjay, Sahil. Okay. Next one. Find the zero of the polynomial. Find the zero of the polynomial. 5x plus 5x square plus 5. 5x square plus 5x. Find the zero of the polynomial. Why did you understand, man? You listen. I, after I uh, rub the board, you ask me why did you understand. What is the question now? My, uh, what I said, a square, e a square equal to 25. So what is the answer? A equal to what? 5, not only 5, minus 5 also that is answer. Why? Plus 5 into plus 5 equal to 25. Minus 5 into minus 5 also 25. That means two answers there is. Clear now. Suppose x square minus 1. x square, x square minus 1. 0 or what? x square equal to 1. x equal to what? Plus or minus 1. That means alpha equal to 1, beta equal to minus 1. Now clear or not? Samja? Hello, Amen. Maybe I don't know how to explain to you, okay? You expand this one. What do you get? X plus one into X minus one, you get about? X plus one into X minus one, that X plus one equal to zero, what is X? X minus one equal to zero, what is X? Okay. Okay, so next, right. Uh, 5x square plus 5x. 5x square plus 5x. Find the zero. 5x square plus 5x. Find the zero. Okay, find this one. Five. Why not checking the previous not? I mean, we already discussed this matter two, three times. I discussed in the previous classes. Why didn't you check that? I didn't learn that. Okay. Find this one. Five x square plus five x. What to do? No, 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 this one, 5x squared plus 5x, what are the zeros? What is the zero? What will do? Take 5x outside x plus 1. So what? 5x equal to 0. That means x equal to 0. x plus 1 equal to 0. x equal to minus 1. For all what? Right? Clear or not? 5x square, 5x square plus 5x. 5x take it outside. 5x into x plus 1. 5x equal to 0. x equal to 0. And x, uh, then zeros are what? Zero and minus one. We all got this. Hello, you got or not? Okay. Zumba, finish. Okay, next question. You try. Find the value of A and B. Find the value of A and B. 
find the value of a and b if they are the zeros of if they are the zeros of x square plus ax plus b okay find the value of a and b find the value of a and b if find the value of a and b if they are the zeros of find the value of a and b if they are the zeros of x square plus ax plus b find the value of find the value of find the value of a and b if they are the zeros of x square plus ax plus b x square plus ax plus b okay fine Okay, finish. Hello, what is that? Uh, look, the question is uh, find the values of a find uh, find the values of a and b if they are the zeros x square plus a x x square plus a x plus b. A and B are the zeros. 
a plus b equal to what? Minus a. A b equal to b. A b equal to b. Then b cancel a equal to what? One. Right? A equal to one. Then what about b? A equal to one substitute here. One plus b equal to minus one. B uh, okay. A equal to one. Then B equal to what? What do you got B? B equal to minus two. Correct or not? B equal to minus two, not zero. Look, A B. Hello. Uh, don't cancel like this. Listen out. A and A and B are the zeros. Correct or not? A and B are the zeros. So A plus B equal to minus A. Okay. Then A B equal to B. B cancel. Cancel me. Cancel me. No zero here. One. A B. Look. A B equal to B. A equal to B by B equal to one. Non cancel me. Actually, yeah. We thought it is uh, okay. Look. Hey, you didn't get it. Come on. Hello. Tell me. Listen here. Alpha, beta are the zeros. Look. Alpha, beta are the zeros. Alpha plus beta what? Minus A. Alpha, beta what? B. Agree or not? This part of okay or not? Alpha and beta are the zeros. Then alpha plus beta equal to minus A. Alpha, beta, B. But here alpha is what? A. Plus beta is B. Equal to minus A. Number one. A, B. Equal to B. Okay, A equal to B by B equal to one. Number two. Go to here. A equal to one. One plus B equal to minus one. B equal to what? Minus two. Clear now? Not clear or not? Smart diluted way. Okay. So if not get if not getting, tell me I'll change the method. Okay. I don't know that. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> really, I how to uh, Aman, how to answer? I don't know. Okay. 2x equal to 5. X is what? 2x equal to 5. What is x? Tell me. You are in class 10? No. 2x equal to 5. What is x? Aman, you tell me that. 2x equal to 5. What is x? Aman. Tell me that. 5 by 2. A, B equal to B. A, B equal to B. B equal to what? A, A equal to what? A, B equal to B. A equal to what? B by B. by B. B by B is what? 1. Finish. Now clear? Clear or not? Okay, you should listen. Now you understand, but you should check with our notebook after that. Okay. Then only clear it. Otherwise, you forget about. Okay. Or, or, all, all classes you are recording. You can check again. No, what is we discussed? I just keeping uh, without any edi uh, editing. I just keep it there. Whatever discussed in the class, it is in the YouTube. Okay. Next, if the zeros of polynomial, if the zeros of polynomial, next question. If the zeros of the polynomial x square plus 4x plus 2a, if the zeros of the polynomial x square plus 2x plus 2a are alpha and 2 alpha, hey, sorry, alpha and 2 by alpha, if the zeros of the polynomial, if the zeros of the polynomial if the if the zeros 
if if the uh, if the zero of the polynomial x square plus 4x plus 2a 2a are alpha and 2 by alpha alpha and 2 by alpha find the value of a find the value of a okay you find out Okay, finish. Question. If the zeros of the polynomial, if the zeros of the polynomial, everyone should attend the test. Okay. If not attending, I will drop your name for the group. If the zero of the polynomial, if the zeros of the polynomial x square plus 4x plus 2a. If, if the zero of the polynomial x square plus 4x plus 2a are alpha and 2 by alpha. First zero is alpha. Second zero is 2 by alpha. Okay, find out. Okay, clear now. X square plus, sorry, x square plus 4x plus 2a, zeros are alpha and 2 by alpha. Find the value of a, find the value of a. It's really, the problem is you, you did not study the previous norm. We did same question here. Okay, what to do? Simple. I've already got some guys. Correct or no? Product. 
alpha into 2 by alpha equal to 2a by 1. Cancel. 2 equal to 2a, a equal to 1. Okay. Okay. A equal to 1. Next question, by the way. Okay. Right. Right. Now, some questions from the first chapter. Explain whether, explain whether, explain whether 3 into 12 into 101 plus 4 is a prime is a prime is a prime number or composite number explain whether explain whether 3 into 12 into 101 plus 4 is a composite number or a prime number is a composite number or a prime number It is composite number, right? What to do? 3 into 12, we can write 3 into 4 plus into 101 plus 4. What's the common here? 4 common here, right? Don't multiply and find out. Okay. So 4 outside, 3 into 3 into 1 into 101 plus 1. Okay. 4 into, what is this one? 101 into 9. 909 plus 1. That is 4 into 910. 910, we can factorize it. What? 910, we can factorize and write. 9102 and factorize and write. This is a composite number. I copied it like that, right? Sanjay. Sanjay. Swatha. We did all like this, right? Zaba. Divanch. Everyone did like this only, right? Why every question you ask is repeat the repeat the question. Question only here, man. Every time you ask me what repeat, repeat the question. What? You can see the board. You cannot see the board and you can see the uh, voice. Every question you ask me, repeat, repeat the question. What? Everyone finish already. Something wrong with your net. 
I think you have no connection with the chapters and all. You are defeated now. You already done. You are ready for test today. You already done this one. Same question. You took uh, what we did twelve. We split into three into four. This twelve. Three into four. Four outside. Three same. Three same. Instead of four, one. One zero one. Then three into three. Nine into one zero one. Okay. So that is a composite number. Try one more question like this. Okay. Try one more question. Okay. I'm just repeating same question. Another question. Okay. Seven into. Seven into thirteen into eleven plus eleven. Seven into thirteen into eleven plus eleven. Okay, fine. Okay, it's a composite number, right? Okay. So next question. Right, whether right whether two root of forty five plus three root of twenty divided by two root five. Two root of forty five plus three root of twenty. On simplification, on simplification, it's a it's an irrational or rational number. Is an irrational number or rational number? Okay, forget about. Check whether this rational or irrational. Check whether this rational or irrational. That's only. Check whether this rational or irrational. Okay, try now. Check whether this rational or irrational. Okay. Simplify and check is it rational or irrational.
is rational or irrational? I don't know. Look at here. We forgot that. Listen. Root of 45 is what? 45 is 9 into 5. 2 into 3 root 5. Correct or not? Root of 45 is root of 45. Listen. Root of 45 is root of 9 into 5. 9 is root of 9 is 3. 3 5. Plus 3 into root of 20 what? 2 root 5. Correct or not? You remember the table? 2 root 5. Divided by 2 root 5. Okay. 6 root 5 plus 6 root 5 divided by 2 root 5. 12 root 5 divided by 2 root 5. Cancel. Answer what? 6. It's a rational number. Correct? So all got this. Um, Anugrah, you got? Hello, Anugrah. Hello, Anugrah. Where is he? You got? Okay. Now understood how to do this one. Yeah, you understood now? Root of 45, root of 45, find out. How much? Root of 45 is root of 9 into 5. So 9 root is 3, 3 root 5. So that's why 6 root 5 here. Root of 20 is, uh, root of 20 is 2 root 5. 6 root, uh, 6 root 5. Actually, last year we by had this all. You remember or not? Root 8, 2 root 2. Root of 12, 2 root 3. Root of 18, 3 root 2. Root of 20, uh, 2 root 5. Root of 24, 2 root 6. Root of 27, 3 root 3. You remember or not? Last year, friends. Hello, table 2. Akshaya, Kesia, no, Kesia not there. Uh, even there. You remember or not? Last year, we might have to this solve because uh, every time, every time this question comes, which one below? root of 27. So we can directly write. Okay, anyway, no matter. Now, 45, we can write what? 45, 3, 15, 5, 5. 2, 5 there is. That is means uh, 5 root 3. No, here 3, 3, that's okay, sorry, 3. So 3, uh, 3 root, uh, root of 45 is 3 root 5. Okay, root of 45 is 3 root 5. Root of 10 is 2 root 5. So uh, 6 root 5, 12 root 5 divided by 2 root 5. That means 6. Okay. Mm, okay. Okay. Without actual division. Without actual division, find the... Without actual division, find the... Without actual division, find the decimal form. Without actual division, find the decimal form. 257 divided by 500. 257. 257 divided by 500. 257 divided by 500. 257 divided by 500. Two fifty seven divided by Shahid. Are you getting or not? So uh, next Sunday onwards, new chapter will start. Linear equations in two variables. Okay. And I have some question pending. Question. What the question I said? Uh, without actual division, find two fifty seven divided by five hundred. 257 divided by 500. Okay. Okay, Drew, you are by heart because many times we discuss the same question.
Okay. Finish. What? Who is asking this question? Who is asking this question? Uh, Ahmed. 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 Hello, Ahmed. Don't write the question. Don't write the test. Okay. Okay. Don't write it because you didn't learn anything. Now you're asking whether both chapters coming or not. I already published the net. I already published our group. Okay. Don't write the test. Okay. Don't waste my time. Okay. I don't want to waste my time. I I already last yesterday. I uh, I every class I said today's test is uh, so and so chapter. Correct or not? Right? Yeah, uh, already in the class I said the timing and everything I said. And yesterday I posted in our group. Okay. Then again you are asking me uh, the test is I already said please note that tomorrow test chapters. Real numbers and polynomials, full chapter, right? Then what? Then why are you asking me this question? Hello, what? you you see this one at eight forty eight p.m. You see, okay? Correct or no? You wasting the time, so don't write the test, okay? I I want check your paper. Don't don't send me. I don't want your paper today, okay? Clear now? What is this? I, I don't want anyone to test without preparation at all. Okay. So look at here. You have one hour now. I'll stop now. You one hour then. Uh, go through all the chapters. Very limited portions. Nothing to do from my side. I am repeating same same question only. Okay. Ready, ready for the test. You'll get the test paper at sharp nine o'clock. Okay.